convenient and powerful way of creating dynamic regional color changes in your videos is to use a selection mask and keyframes. In this tutorial, we show you how to use the regional adjustment tool selection mask combined with keyframes to create dynamic regional color changes to your videos. As you can see, the fish is constantly moving. If we want to change the color of some parts of the fish's body, we need a powerful and very precise tool. Let's use Color Director's Selection Mask. After dragging the video into the tray at the bottom, select the Adjustment tab at the top and click the Regional Adjustment Tools tab. You are presented with all three Regional Adjustment Tools. Selection Mask, Motion Tracking Mask and Gradient Mask. Let's click the Selection Mask button. You first need to create a new mask. At the top, click the New drop-down menu. Click to add a first selection point. You now need to define the feather of your selection mask. To define the most appropriate feather amount, take into account how hard the object's edges are. For sharp edges, use a smaller feather. For more diffuse edges, use a bigger feather value. We'll use a small amount of feather since the fish has very sharp edges. Now we can start to create our selection mask on our video. Draw to the next point, click again to add a second selection point and so on till you completely outline your shape. Roll over the first selection point, click to finalize and close your selection mask. In the center of the mask, you can see a colored reference point. Click it and drag to reposition the entire mask. You can also reposition each selection point. Roll over a selection point. You can now drag to a new location. You can also add new selection points to your selection mask. Drag your mouse over a blue line linking two existing points and click. A new selection point will appear. Roll over that new point and drag it anywhere you want to more precisely adjust the mask. Now press the play button to the point you want your selection mask to end. Pause the footage. Because either the camera has panned or the object has moved, the mask no longer matches the fish you want to modify. We need to readjust the mask so that it covers the fish in its new position. First, open the keyframe setting panel at the top left by clicking the clock icon. You can already see the first keyframe at the beginning. This is the mask you created earlier. We now have to readjust this. Start by rolling over the red selection point inside the mask and drag it to match the new shape and position of the fish. You can also move each selection point individually for even more precision. As you started to modify the mask, a new keyframe was automatically created in the keyframe setting panel. This is the second mask we just made. Now, if you replay the footage starting from the first keyframe, you can see that Color Director intelligently interpolates the sequence between the two masks to precisely follow the moving shape you want to modify. Once you've finished creating your selection mask, you can now adjust the tool options to achieve the color changes of your choice. Let's say we want to replace with a blue color. Let's decrease the white balance temperature option we now have a new blue fish.